guys, so if you've ever looked inside of the Smart Plans tab in Command, then you may have seen this little blue box here that talks about a Twilio account not being connected. So what exactly is a Twilio account and how does it interact with the Smart Plans? Without having Twilio set up in your command, any steps in a Smart Plan that require a text message will come in as a task reminder for you to manually text each of those contacts. However, if you have Twilio set up, it'll allow you to send those text messages just to be sent out automatically. So there's no extra work on your end. Once you add them to the smart plan, they're definitely gonna be getting that text message. It'll also allow you to go ahead and reach out to the contacts that you have using the KW Command app. The KW Command app is pretty new, um, so this is a really cool feature about it. You won't have to use your personal cell phone number. Instead, you can opt to use your Twilio number to text or call your clients. Now, this is done by purchasing a monthly subscription of credits, and those credits go towards the text messages that you're sending out. If it's a multimedia message, it's going to be a slightly um, higher credit than if it was just a standard text message. So if you're adding images, videos, files, things like that, it's going to take out more credits than just a normal text message would. So you're going to have to purchase these credits. However, any unused credits for the month will go ahead and roll over to the new month. So the first step in setting up this Twilio number for your command is hitting right here where it says subscribe in KW Marketplace or clicking on your name at the top, going into your settings, and if you are on a team, please make sure that you are underneath your personal account rather than your team account. That way it is tied to specifically you. When you go into your settings, it's gonna automatically pull up all of the applications that you already have connected to your command. Once you're inside of your settings, you're gonna scroll all the way to the bottom and there's gonna be the Twilio option right here. If you want to, go ahead and hit subscribe in Marketplace and it's gonna take you to the KW Marketplace where you can purchase applications to tie into your command. So once you hit buy now, it's gonna pull up this screen right here where you can see all of the different credit plans that they have. So you can get anywhere from 300 credits to 15,000 credits depending on how often you are using this text messaging feature. And it's gonna let you know how much you do once you're checking out. So you're gonna go through, put in your credit card information, go ahead and finalize that order. And you'll go right back into your settings and next to Twilio, Instead of saying subscribe in Marketplace, it's now gonna say select number. Now it'll prompt you once you hit select number to go ahead and enter the desired number that you want and how close you want your number to be to that desired number. It's gonna pull up any available numbers that they have that are close to what you would like and you're just gonna claim the number that you want your text to be sent from. Now something to note is that you cannot use your personal cell phone number here. It is not going to let you do that. Um, you can only use whatever numbers that they generate for you. So then once you've gone ahead and claimed your number, any text messages that are a part of a smart plan will automatically send out to your contacts rather than generating you that task to go in your taskbar. You can also now go into the KW Command app and choose to send your messages using either your cell phone or your Twilio number. Someone does respond to your Twilio message, you're gonna get a notification in a couple different areas. Again, this is coming from a Twilio number, not your cell phone number, so it's not gonna come in like a normal text message. Instead, it's gonna go straight back into your command. So you're gonna be getting a couple different notifications. The first will be inside of this little bell here in command. It'll let you know what the message is and what came through, and you can go check it out and respond to it. It'll also send you a notification if you have the KW Command app. Um, and that is honestly the best way to receive those notifications. So if you do not have the KW Command app and you wanna use Twilio, I do highly suggest that you get that downloaded. That text message will also live inside of the contacts timeline so you can see exactly how they responded and if you want to mark it as anything special. If someone is outside of your contact database, meaning you do not already have them in your command, 
and they decide to text your Twilio phone number, it will go ahead and create a new contact for you inside of Command itself. Um, along with this, you'll still be receiving the normal notifications as well as it'll also pop in your timeline for you. So the whole goal of this is hopefully to make your guys' life just a little bit easier. So if you're wanting to send a text through the KW app, you would open the app up, choose the text message icon next to the name that you would like to send, and then it's gonna pop up here where it says, are you gonna send using your Twilio account? So it's gonna let you know up at the top that it is a Twilio text message from here. You can add emojis, your files, images, anything that you need to send, and it's gonna send it all in one text message and adjust your credits afterwards. So from there, it'll take you to the next screen where it'll let you know exactly how many credits you're gonna be using, how much you have left to use for the month, like I said a little bit earlier, you will be getting command notifications from the app if somebody does respond. So it's going to pop in there and you're going to be able to see um, what the message was. If you hit view details, it's going to pull you into that timeline just like it would on the desktop where you can respond and see exactly what's happening. So that's everything that I have on Twilio right now. If you guys are interested in learning more, please sign up for an appointment with us at letsgettechie.com or just respond here in the comments.